Siege is in the mid game. And now that new new pick going to do double duty. That's true. Very nice composition from SK Telecom. Spenu looking for that primary engage. A lot of their composition is going to depend on whether Sejuani can hit those ults so Kennen can get the follow up. Desire, Trevor. <laughs> All right, Pink Ward's going to see catch. Should Deposit be able to see that war war too, and Secret's gonna have to flash out his wolf head, but it's nuclear back. There's the exhaust, and nuclear choosing not to use flash. He just accepts his fate as Bengi shows up, and Marin gets a first blood. Too much of a jerk though with the wolf spirit. Yeah, catch smiting that out right away. Or early. is he? Oh yeah, he's ready for the blue. <laughs> but we're gonna see Sasan go right ahead. Bang actually gets caught by Secret. He's gonna have to flash and heal out. He's gonna try to turn things around with the Cully. Secret trying to block as much damage as possible, so Wolf's just gonna turn onto the Nautilus. He's just gonna get ahead, but it back once again. There's Boomerang Blade onto Bang, but not enough damage as the Ignite goes down. And Bengi still trying to be a jerk. Never give up. And oh, go. he's setting things up for Faker. Oh, and he gets the steal. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Oh, the last hit from Sasan coming and helping Faker out right there. Treads. Try and dodge some of the shurikens coming out and have that. Wow, Faker. Okay, buddy. Yeah, he missed the cannon minions. He was mad. So like, <laughs> might as well skip the rest of the minions just to get damage out of Sasan. And oh wow! Yeah, Sasa doesn't have really blue, careful. and Faker does. So Faker's actually going to go for a dive here. He's going to heal out, and he's going to have to flash to get the kill. Will he go down to the? Oh, one last tower <laughs> in. Ah, Faker got a little greedy there. Faker was pretty confident, but Sasa, I mean, flashed away to create some distance, securing the tower hits, and Bengi showing up in top lane. They're trying to put some pressure down to Soul because he's already at half health, and there's the ultimate coming in. They will both be stunned, but tons of flame spitter damage as Bengi. Is going for the dragon teleport coming in from Rumble, and there's the culling. The dragon still goes in favor of Spin. And Wolf is in the pit. Nuclear and Soul should be able to get out it with Sasan right there. But Secret and Catch, although also both flash out of the pit. So dragon taken by Spin, who some summoners used for that. Yeah, both TPs used right here, and Faker still. Oh, Soul flashes forward for the slice of mail, so he gets the stun, but there's Marin overeating, though, so he's not going to be able to catch it. Oh, nice headbutt into the knockoff, and Marin picks up the kill and a double with the Flame Spitter. Wow, Faker really knowing his limits right there, having faith that his team could come back in on that one because Soul had his flash up. Yeah. And he really can dictate where people can and can't go. And here we go. Well, again, get top lane. Dredge lane not going to hit onto Mar, but there's the ultimate coming in from Nautilus. Mar turns it around with an equalizer, though. Secret oh! will get taken out with the help of a true shot barrage as Catch comes in to help with the kill that will actually go to Secret with the Ignite. Marin. Okay. It's going to be one of those <laughs> kind of games. <laughs> I, I, see I, how it, I see how it's going to be, Marin. <laughs> a double knockup for Catch as Bang shows up, and that should be a kill as he also tries to secure a kill onto Secret, leaving it for Faker to take that kill, but Bengi's going to take down the Sejuani. Bang shows up with Faker to push down the mid lane, double AD. And Bengi still zoning out every member of Spenu, but there's a nice dredge lane and the slow, but absolute zero in the brush, and then flash out! Bengi's going to make the escape as Faker blinks forward, and Sasan gets caught to Bang, and Bang not going to get one last hit onto Sasin. Oh, oh, wow. Nice dodge by Sasin on that one. And Dredge Lane keeps Wolf back. Go. And there's a teleport from Soul. Can he get the stun out to Bang? He does, but no damage to follow up. So Bang and Faker will just try to turn around. Bangy pretty low, though. So they got to watch out. Boomerang Blade comes down onto Faker. But he has Arcane Shift in secret. Where are you going? Without really much of a mission. There's the Equalizer. Oh, he gets booted back <laughs> onto the Equalizer. Everyone trying to stack Marin's Majestic Soul Stealer as the double kill goes to the rumble. Somehow, <laughs> Secret killed Faker in all of that what? as well. A victory right now. Massive, absolutely massive gold lead. And, and on the hunt coming from Spender, they want to catch anyone on escape. Nice disrupt, and the equalizer out to the absolute zero as Soul comes in, but he's just going to get exhausted. Marin Hat didn't have his Flame Spitter on, but Bang has the damage to follow up. There's a Flame Spitter following through. True Shot Barrage not going to hit anyone. By the way, that was a 5v4, <laughs> but just the ult combo and that's one of the problems with Kennen is he's so item dependent, and you can see how little damage this Kennen is doing right now as Catch <laughs> and Bengi chase each other around the jungle. Oh, oh Catch can't find the angle to jump over the wall thanks to the Krugs. Times.
then it should get taken care of pretty quickly. Yeah, Marin's also coming to join after pushing up that top lane. Spinner knows what's going on, but Sasa's gonna be met with a big surprise as the Magia stacks start to do their work. 13 stacks for Marin. <laughs> He has nearly 400 AP <laughs> at 22 minutes into this game. <laughs> Does soak it in with Spell Shield for nuclear, but not Marin so much for secret. Marin is doing All right, Marin. I mean, you <laughs> had four easy kills here with your Equalizer, but he's going to do Krugs as Faker tries to go for a kill. He is actually going to pick it up onto Soul and SKT. It's this Rumble. Yeah, he's just looking Alt. for an answer. There's the absolute zero from Bengi, just keeping him rid of band. There's the Equalizer as he flashes forward, but his Flame Spinner is turning his back. And Marin's not going to be able to go for the kills as Bang and Faker come in and oh, the shutdown. The 20 stack dream is over. Spenu wins the moral <laughs> game, morale game here in game two. But SKT will take the win and they'll get a clean 2 0 in the first week of Champion Summer. Yeah, and they really brought it together after su uh, summoning Bengi and Faker to the booth in that second game. Struggled a little bit in game one, but that time really.